guys, welcome to Over the Mooney. My name is Katie and today I have a very, very exciting Bippity unboxing to be sharing with you guys. I cannot wait to dig into this box because I just, I just have a feeling it's gonna be a good one. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I have that feeling with basically every single Bippity box. They're all good ones, but I just, I just have a feeling that it's gonna be a good one. So I cannot wait to get into it and to show you guys what is inside. If you are unfamiliar with Bippity, they are an amazing subscription box company that covers pretty much every fandom genre that you can think of. They have core boxes based on Harry Potter, Disney, Marvel, and Star Wars, but then they also have tons, tons more of fandom things on their wish list that you are able to choose from every single month. So it is such a great, great company to subscribe to. They have so many fun things that you can get inside of your box. And I always look forward to opening their boxes whenever I get them every single month. So I'm sure that you will too. <laughs> and I cannot wait to get inside this box with you guys. If you are new here to my channel, then hello and welcome. I would absolutely love it if you guys would hit that subscribe button down below to become a part of our little corner of the internet. We talk about Disney, Harry Potter, DIY, and collectibles, and we post two times a week, so all of those new videos will pop right on up in your subscription feed once you are subscribed. Also, if you like this video, if you like this kind of video, or if you just like me, then please feel free to give this video a big thumbs up. It is such a quick, free, and easy way to show your favorite content creators here on YouTube how much you appreciate them, and we appreciate that. And you will have to let me know if you are subscribed to Bippity yourself, and if you are, then please leave those unboxings down in the comments. I love to watch them. Or you can just let me know what you got if you do not have a channel, which I completely understand. <laughs> so before I jump into this box, I did just want to let you guys know two quick things. Number one, I am a rep for this company, which does mean that I get this box for free to review for you guys. But as I always mentioned before these, I was a subscriber before I was a rep. So I do absolutely love these boxes and love this company. I think that they do such a wonderful job with everything that they put together for everyone. And I also wanted to let you know that because I am a rep, I do have a promo code to offer you guys and that is over the Mooney. that's gonna save you 10% off of your very first box as well as throw in a free sparkle pack into your box it's gonna be a pack full of super cute stickers and magnets I used to get that pack when I was a subscriber and I used to add that onto my boxes and I loved it it was so much fun just another little extra thing to bring some magic into your day so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna cut on in to this box and we are gonna see what is inside all right so I am pulling out they're beautiful bippity package. I am also pulling out the packing slip, so you don't want to look at that if you don't want your items to be spoiled. So I see a big giant something in here, but I'm not going to pull that out quite yet because I definitely <laughs> want to save that. But I am also seeing some beautiful ears. Oh my goodness. I think these are the periwinkle ears. They're so pretty, oh my gosh, and they're so soft. Oh, they're so beautiful. This bow is just everything. I'm getting complete Elsa vibes from these ears for sure. And it has been a long time since I got ears in any capacity, just in a box or <laughs> at the parks at all. Those are so pretty. Oh my God. Yep, these will definitely be coming with me to the parks for sure oh my god i love that bow love it i never wear ears because <laughs> i'm not good enough to like figure out my filming configuration so that you can actually see my ears in the shot so that's why i never wear ears in case you're wondering but here we are i mean i guess i could just is that better there we go now you can see my ears i'll keep them on for the rest of the video <laughs> i'm also pulling out something that looks super fuzzy and super cute and a shove on in there oh my god oh my god i totally saw these when we were leaving expedition everest and i was like i would need it but i can't justify it i need it but i can't justify it and hey we didn't need to justify it because we got it oh my god so it is one of the little yetis so they did make like cutie versions of the Yeti from Expedition Everest and this is a lady or just like you know a guy who wants to wear a bow either way but oh um, gosh this is so freaking cute it's so soft I wish you guys could feel it here feel it try just try feeling it <laughs> 
It's so cute. Oh my God. Yep. This is wonderful. <laughs> I'm feeling like a very snowy theme right now. Like my feeling like my Elsa ears, which I know these aren't. And then we have this little sweetie. Like, are you freaking kidding me? Eee! So we do have one other item in here before we get to the big ticket item. And this is so pretty. <gasps> This is so beautiful. Look how pretty this is. So this is a magnet. I don't know if this is a magnet that would have been in the sparkle pack, perhaps. But this is so beautiful. I love, love, love all of these colors. Oh, this is going on my refrigerator instantly. <laughs> that is gorgeous. Wow. Wow. Okay. So now we have our big item. It comes in a red box like this. So it is a Jim Shore Disney Traditions designed by Jim Shore from Inesco. I am generally not a big Jim Shore person. However, there are sometimes pieces that speak to me. So I love that they have a wish list because I can favorite items that are in that vein that do speak to me. <laughs> so that is perfect when that happens. And this is for sure one of those items because I, again, kind of have an idea since I have on there, please don't send me any gym shores unless I specifically ask for them. <laughs> so I have a pretty good idea which one this is. <gasps> oh my gosh, this is beautiful. So if you are new here to me and to my channel, I am a huge villains person. I love the villains. Maleficent is definitely a villain that's up there for me. Definitely top five villains. And I saw this figure and I said, yes, please. I need this in my life. This is just truly stunning. So this is called Malevolent Madness. And here she is in all her glory. So obviously we have Maleficent up here with Diablo and her staff and everything. But then on her chest, we have Prince Philip fighting Maleficent as the dragon. There's like this beautiful like flooring that just kind of fades off into nothing. And then of course, just on the back, we just have some nice carving for some shading and making it look a little bit flowy. We have the beautiful thorns are carved into the side of her. This is just a super, super beautiful, stunning figure. So definitely one that needs to live and thrive in my collection for sure. Wow. Wow. This is really beautiful. Yay. So very, very happy with this box. So I'm going to go ahead and go into our packing slip. So this was the ultimate magic box and was curated with love by Becky. Thank you so much, Becky. Becky curated an awesome Harry Potter box for me also. So I will leave a link to that one down below. That box was incredible. I was just like gasping at everything that I pulled out of that box. So we have the custom Disney inspired magnet pastel castles 350. Our Disney traditions Jim Shore figure malevolent madness maleficent was $80. Our Disney parks exclusive ears had band velvet cornflower blue with sequin bow was $29.99 and our Disney Parks exclusive Expedition Everest Yeti plush girl was $19.99 for a total retail value of $133.48. So this box does cost $119 so you definitely get some value back from that which is incredible. I loved this box so much. It was so great. I love these ears. I'm like, I don't even know what, I guess I could wear them to Epcot. I mean, I could wear them everywhere, really, but like Epcot because they have the Frozen and this just reminds me so much of Elsa and I'm channeling a lot of Elsa vibes lately. So this is like perfectly timely. So I'm here for it anyway. Loved this box. You guys will have to let me know what was your favorite item that I received. I loved all of them. I can't even begin to pick a favorite. They're all just so perfect. So definitely let me know if you can pick a favorite in the comments. Which one was your favorite? Let me know. And that is everything that I have for you guys for today. So thank you so, so much for watching. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.